Okay, I'm making a video here for Sam um, with and without the BHI unit used for CW. I'm using a K42 CW keyboard keyer here that I just recently built. Now, I don't have the filter on right now. Conditions aren't the greatest this morning, so obviously making a test will be a pain in the butt, but do what we can. When in doubt, try a different band, I say. Alright, now this is without the filter. So I'm going to go ahead and put the filter in with one. There's one. You can hear it's cleared up the hash. I'm going to try it with two now. That's two. This is three. And now I'll throw in four. And you hear how it's kind of fady a little bit for CW with four. I'll go ahead and uh, crank it off. Actually, I'm taking it back to one. And now I'll kick it off. Okay. Try to find something a little stronger, maybe. That would be nice. I can only do what it's going to let me do, so here you go, CQ, CQ. This is without the filter. Now with one, see how it's, it's significantly taken the, uh, the audio down uh, as far as the hash is concerned. At this point, it's kind of confused on the CW being set. There's two. And I have to crank up my audio a little bit to be able to actually hear it. But this is two. Now I'll throw it up to three, even though he's not sending. Hopefully it'll come back here. Alright, there we go. And hear how it tries to kill the tone. It tries to take the tone out severely. It really takes that tone away. Now I'll go to four. There we are. So now four. 
when you hear I've got to I got to crank up my audio if I'm even going to try to hear it this is made to really really kill the tones it kills tones and that's what this filter does my recommendation for you is to get a SCAF 1 honestly for CW um, for CW work this filter this BHI DSP unit is definitely not going to do the trick here this is without it okay and then even using my own my own filter I'll put my favorite filter in and I'll throw it on one alright there's one a little bit better so you can use your rigs internal um, filtering as well in combination it seems to be okay instead of letting it pick the uh, filtering that I want so we know we got Joe on here. Now we're on. Gonna go to three. There's three. I don't really hear a whole lot going on with the. Uh, it's not doing it for me as far as the audio, cleaning up the audio for CW. Um, it's just not, you know. It's not made to do that. It's not designed to do that. I'm thinking a SCAF-1 is the way to roll. You might want to check that out on uh, YouTube, the SCAF-1. I've seen them for sale. Okay, I'm going to crank it off. All right, so what I'm going to do now then say is turn it down a little bit. I'm going to go find some CW. Make sure she's uh, ready for CW. Not terrible, but not great either. Okay, now here it is without any filtering. Well, it has my own internal filter on the uh, on the rig. Goose and the gander over there don't count. There you go. So anyway, as you can see, the CW key is really not going to do a great job, or at least the filtering is not going to do great with that filter. Now listen to this with this. Now you hear the hash. I'm going to throw one in. There's one. And I'll do two. Let's do three. You still hear a little hash. Let's do four. You can hear it's a lot better for voice. Uh, yeah. you know, this is selecting its own filter. Yeah. I like to use it on oh, M2 down here. Who's here? Who's here? Who's here? You hear how that here? just booms in? Boom. So anyway, without the filter, I, I saw stuff about not terrible. Uh, they're not going to have an air show there this so year. So really, the only way to really test this filtering for you is to find a weak station. Alright, should be locked in. 